hello guys welcome back to the channel so right now we are looking at the at the comparison between the Homer h2 and the 2022 Homer EV so we begin with uh, the production date you had the Homer h2 that was produced between 2003 and 2009 and the Homer uh, EV will debut in 2022 but you actually start getting them delivered in 2023 so uh, to begin with the width you can see that the Homer EV is 86.7 inches wide which is way wider than the Homer H2 uh, the Homer H2 in its day was one of the widest vehicles on the road being that it was a full-sized SUV so the next thing we look at is going to be about the height and uh, you can see that the Homer EV is 81.1 inches wide whereas the Homer H2 is only 77.8 inches and then uh, of course Homers are meant to go off-road so we look at the ground clearance you can see that the h2 uh, the ground clearance was 9.7 inches homer ev 10.1 inches and there is a further extraction mode which adds about five inches to the ground clearance uh, speaking about the weight you can see that the h2 weighed in at about 6400 pounds whereas the homer ev weighs in at a whopping 9000 pounds you got to put all those batteries somewhere and they're heavy they're not light and uh, the good thing is uh, most of that weight is going to be slung low that's uh, underneath uh, the vehicle so it helps with stability so we talk now about the length and remember this came in two versions and also for the Hummer EV uh, you have the truck and then you have the SUV the SUVs tend to be shorter so the figures you see there the numbers are for the suvs so uh let's talk about the range for the h2 the range was about 390 uh, miles with a full tank and the homa ev it's about 329 miles uh, the H2 has a 32 gallon tank it's a massive tank so the H2 came in three different uh, engine variants as time went on and it puts out about 316 325 or 393 horsepower depending on the version whereas the Homer EV puts out more than a thousand horsepower calculated it's got three engines one up front and two in electric motors in the back uh, for the wheelbase you can see that uh, the Homer EV has a longer wheelbase and longer wheelbase generally will equate with a smoother ride now let's talk about the torque uh, calculating the torque for the Hummer EV you know from all those three motors and the gearing that's involved will show that it can produce theoretically up to 11,000 pounds and then for off-roaders this is very important feel free to uh, pause as necessary to look at the various approach departure and breakover angles in both vehicles but overall uh, the Homer EV wins and then the one feature that the H2 never had uh, is the crab walk I don't know if it's a gimmick but somehow uh, everybody seems to love it and it's uh, when you have the Homa uh, EV that it's, it moves kind of slides sideways. So you have the front wheel turning and the rear wheel turning. 0 to 60. The Homa EV can do that in under 3 seconds. Even though it's advertised a little bit higher than that. Uh, the Homa H2 struggled with uh, 0 to 60. It, it's, it, it wasn't a race vehicle and then for the price you can see back in 2003 when the h2 came out it was about fifty thousand dollars whereas the homer ev is more than double that thanks for watching catch you guys on the next one